profile line. That's how they travel. Wednesdays begin typically enough at the Neighborhood Youth Corps summer program with rigid lines and reprimands from the officers before they walk across the street to the police academy for exercises. Entering the gym, however, it's time for Kai Chi Do, a meditation and music exercise that helps the group focus and relax. This recess is just one part of a summer program that tries to break down the wall between Chicago's youth and the police and teaches these kids the importance of leadership and volunteerism. The more educated people are, you know, that's, that's, that's actually what's going to help the city fight crime. We need to spend more time on these kids because these are the kids they are either becoming victims or are the victimizers. So focusing on these kids will help reducing crime in the city of Chicago. It's like when you, when you get that up close view and that personal connection with the officers, it's like it changed your opinion about the other officers because you don't look at them all the same anymore. The cops are hard on you, but they, they help a lot. They help a lot. With, not just in the class, but with real life situations, they help a lot. In our neighborhood, the CHA, there's a closed mouth or a don't say when it comes to community and the police. So now they get a chance to see the police on a different level as not as being afraid of them or somebody who we're out to hurt them, but somebody within the community that's willing to work with them. Coming up from Inglewood gave me a different perspective on policing. The program also features lectures from a variety of people from law enforcement, and the kids spend a day out of each week volunteering for different charities across the city. Yeah, I, I think it's really important to be involved in your community because if you don't know the neighborhood you live in, what community do you have? Like, if you won't help your neighbors or help the people around you who live close to you, like, I feel like it unifies you, it unifies us, and I feel like that's what our city needs the most. People need help, everyone needs help. And volunteer work is really not that hard. And then you will learn from that volunteer work and you will help others. For students and police, it was a memorable six weeks. I will always remember this experience and it, it taught me a lot because it taught me to exercise my own self-control and I can't do what I want to do when I want to do it. Like, that's just not reality when you're an adult. You get attached to these kids. I mean, it's only five, six weeks. But, you know, you, you just want the best for them. You know, I have kids of my own and, you know, it's like they're our kids. You want to make sure that they're fine and that nothing happens to them and, you know, that for them to be successful. There's lots of people saying that as me being a young person cannot do much, but I want to show them that I could do more than what they expect me not to do.